Hey everyone, it's Up North Collectors here. We are celebrating the Lions victory going to the championship series of the NFC to make it to the Super Bowl and obviously win the Super Bowl. So why not open up some 2023 Dunruss Football holiday blaster boxes with the chance at pulling it downtown. Already pulled one downtown out of one of these blasters. Let's get a second one. Let's see if we can find any awesome Lions rookie cards in here or any CJ Stroud uh, rookie cards out of these. These are pretty fun. Um, Walmart had these on their site last week still. I um, mean, they're hard to find at some other places. So you get, of course, the sweater relic and then one of the optic red green cards. You get 90 cards in a box and then a chance for downtowns in these uh, as well. So you can see what you can get there um you know there's uh, as far as value goes i don't know if the, the value is better at uh, the regular or with the regular blasters or the holidays but i do like the fact that with the holidays you do get still a chance to get downtowns and a chance or and you get the optic cards in them guaranteed plus you get the sweater relics those are kind of fun so let's move the camera down just a wee bit and let me know your prediction. Who's going to the Super Bowl? Obviously, it's the Lions. 49ers don't have a chance. Um, and uh, you have Kansas City and Ravens. I'm going to say for the Lions, their best chance is going to be to beat the Chiefs. So I'm going to say Chiefs, Lions, and the Super Bowl. Let me know what you think. I actually think the Ravens are going to make it. The Ravens look really good. They destroyed the Lions earlier in the year um and that was a horrible weather game and old jared goff not really great in the outside elements so uh but at the super bowl it's going to be indoors so no no worries there all right let's get into this pack here where is all the good stuff at in the back usually um uh, nolan smith and oh there we go cj stroud right off the bat that's not a bad start cj stroud rookie card we'll take that Obviously, he did not perform. I can't get this back card off. There it is, a uh, canvas, and Jalen Hyatt. Um, but yeah, he did not perform the greatest against the Ravens, but look who he's playing, the Ravens. So uh, let's put this card over here, CJ Stroud. We'll put him over there so he doesn't fall over. All right, so definitely a good quarterback to pull. We'll take that any day for first pack. Pretty good start. Let's see what we can get out of the second pack here. Hopefully something even better, maybe a parallel. I would love to get a red-green optic of um, Mr. Stroud. But let's see. Here's our rookies, uh, Spears, and we have this guy. And then we have a bomb squad of Jackson Smith. All right. This one feels thick, so it must be our relic and optic pack. Our downtown pack is coming later. I just have a feeling. I have a feeling there's going to be a downtown in one of these two blasters. I'd say on average, I'm guessing, they're like one in every 20 blasters. I don't know. Is there 20 in a case now? Is that right? Or is it 24? I can't remember. Uh, but I'm guessing it's about one per case. All right, so here is our rookie. And then our sweater relic is going to be right behind it. And Tank Bigsby. And then we have... PJ. And they're sweet looking cards. I do like them. Um, the red green. So here is the look of the sweater. That's pretty sweet. Nice little wrinkle there too. Um, Tank Bigsby. Nice looking sweater relic. The one thing I don't like is that they put the sweater relic and the optic card in the same pack. I wish they wouldn't do that, but you know, that is just what they do, and I don't know why they did it, but it does take away a little bit of the fun out of these boxes because, you know, you're if you're opening up with somebody else as well, like let's say you buy it, you and your your kid or you and a buddy, and you wanted to split a box, and then you're like, oh, well, whoever gets that gets both the good cards. That's not always that fun. There's Christian Gonzalez. We have Zach and Mr. Kid Reporter card in the back. All right, this is a fun that i do like it and i do think that you know for the money uh it's a pretty good buy these were 27 dollars at um or 28 dollars at 
Walmart, so not bad at all. I know at Target they're 25, but you can't buy them online at Target. And my Meyer had them and has a bunch of them, but they're 35 bucks. So I was like, eh, I'd rather buy them cheaper um, and <laughs> not spend as much money. Per all right, there's a Rashid Rice. A good player for the Chiefs. Dalton Kincaid. And let's see what this card is. In the back, we have, oh, nice. Anthony Richardson, Elite Series. That's not bad. Take that. That's a sweet card. All right, put that out in the back there. Let's get on to the last pack of box number one. Then we'll open up the second box. Um, I haven't pulled any good Lions rookies yet. Come on. Let's go. I want a Sam Laporta or a Jameer Gibbs or a Brian Branch. Take any of those guys. Lions had a killer draft class. Sorry, Mr. Kittle, but you are going down in a loss to the Lions this weekend. Uh, McBride and Deuce Vaughn. All right, what's this last card here? Let's see. God, these things are sticking to the back. A White Hot Rookies, Jalen Carter. He definitely was a good rookie for the Eagles. Eagles, man, they I don't know what happened to them, but last half of the season, boy, just not a good uh, second half of the season for the Eagles overall. All right, let's see here. Tampa Bay played a very good game against the Lions. They actually were quite the opponent. Um... Baker Mayfield threw that pick at the end, but even so, that, that was going to be pretty difficult for them to score a touchdown, and then they would have to get the um, two-point conversion just to tie the game. So then it would just went into overtime, but hey, they did they did play a very good game. Um, it, was, it was fun to watch. I wish the Lions would have just been able to shut them down a little early, earlier, but hey, when it push came to shove, they won. And in the playoffs, it doesn't matter if you win by 50 or by one point. You're just trying to get to the next round. Um, that's all that matters. And then in the Super Bowl, a win is a win, as they say. So, hey, you're the champ. Whether you win by one or by 10 points, doesn't matter. All right, so there we go. Mr. Jared Goff, Gridiron Kings. Let's go. For my Detroit Lions. You know, if you think I'm over-hyping this, it's not really because I've been a Lions fan my entire life. They've won like one playoff game or two playoff games in my entire life, I believe. Um, they hardly ever make it to the playoffs, let alone never win. They've never been in a Super Bowl. So it's kind of like being a Chicago Cubs fan back in the day before they won a World Series. That's the other thing I can compare it to. We have a Jonathan Amingo wide receiver, the rookies. These are, I do like to look at those parallels. I'll well, save that pack till the end. That's going to be our special pack. So save that one to the end. When I did get um, the downtown, it was on the very uh, back of the pack, and it was um, flipped over, so like like this on the back, just like that um, Jonathan Mingo was. Um, and so when you open up the pack on the back, if you see something sh really shiny and you you know, want to be surprised at the end. Don't look at it because it will show you right away. And then obviously you pull it downtown. There's a Jalen Carter. We got this Deuce Vaughn. Um, so yeah, anyways, that's just a little hint. If you did pull one, just do this so you don't see the back. All right, well, let's see. If you feel something that feels like it's shiny, doesn't mean it's a downtown, but it's better than just plain old cardboard because, hey, at least you have a shot, right? There he is, Dicker the kicker. Um, good kicker for the Chargers. They picked him up uh, last year, and the guy was pretty darn good. Dicker the kicker. I know, kind of an interesting way to say it, but that's, that's what they say in TV. Brock Purdy, he'll be sacked a million times, hopefully. All right, Sean Clifford, and we have Mr. Peter. Peter, show us something good. Jalen Carter. Elite Series Rookie. All right, so got a couple good rookies in there. Um, it would be nice to see CJ Stroud as the uh, rookie in that. But, hey, we'll take 
that we already got we did pull one cj stroud so we're not complaining we got our boy these are all flipped over we got our last pack to go that has the optic and the relic in it so save the best for last maybe what do we have here for our rookies we have quinton johnson and mr bryce young so not bad at all bryce young quinton johnson and our last pack thanks so much for watching Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Looking for some new stuff to come out. I think Stadium Club comes out this week, baseball-wise. So we will be opening up Stadium Club uh, baseball. And I always love that set. It's like super late. So um, it'd be fun to rip a hobby box and some retail of Stadium Club. Looking forward to that for sure. Um, and so stay tuned for those videos. Also have a Prism retail box coming in. So that'll be fun. Prism football retail box. And then I'm going to do some shorts with some um, Prism uh, basketball. So stay tuned for those. Hopefully pull some big Wemby cards out of there. All right, see who this is. It is going to be Stenson Bennett. And what is our optic? It is Tyreek Stevenson for the Bears. All right, well, that's pretty cool. Um, a little patch there. All right, Stenson Bennett for your Rams. And then for your bears, there you go. So there you have it, guys. Mr. CJ Stroud, there he is. All right, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And of course, as always, go Lions. All right, see you guys. Take care. Have fun collecting. Thanks for watching.